Thank you for your interest in both vermicomposting and the Michigan Soil Works CFT. I think this is an excellent solution for mid-scale vermicomposters and beyond. My name is Steve Churchill and I own a small business called the Urban Worm Company here on the outskirts of Philadelphia. Now my business is focused more on the home vermicomposter, but we also operate a 16-foot Michigan Soil Works CFT to produce worm castings for our own operation. Over the next few videos, I'm going to discuss the basics of vermicomposting and a concept called continuous flow. I'm also going to discuss how a Michigan Soil Works CFT is designed and manufactured. I'm also going to describe the startup process and how we operate our Michigan Soil Works CFT here at the Urban Worm Company, and we're going to pass along some lessons learned. So what is vermicomposting? Well, vermicomposting is the consumption and decomposition of organic waste via an ecosystem of earthworms and microbes. This produces a rich, valuable, biologically diverse uh, end product called vermicompost. Especially when coupled with traditional hot composting, vermicomposting is an excellent way to recycle organic waste. But this creates a highly sought after soil amendment that is up to 20 times more valuable than regular compost. So what is continuous flow and what is a CFT? So most batch vermicomposting methods, say in a Rubbermaid bin, require you to destroy or disrupt the ecosystem of worms and microbes in order to extract the worm castings or the finished vermicompost uh, from the container. Continuous flow leverages worms' tendency to stay in the top six to eight inches of their habitat, allowing you to feed from the top but collect the worm castings from the bottom without disturbing that ecosystem. So how does a Michigan Soil Works CFT perform this harvest? Well, the bottom floor of a Michigan Soil Works CFT, which is raised up off the ground, is a galvanized metal mesh. And just above this metal mesh is a stainless steel cutting bar that is pulled from end to end, which disturbs the bottom one to two inches of the vermicompost, allowing it to fall through that mesh grating to the floor below, or perhaps to a tarp, a conveyor, or some other catch mechanism that you may have. Continuous flow is efficient because the harvest is happening 12 inches below that six to eight inch active layer where the worms and microbes are doing the hard work. There is never a full emptying of the bin or a disruption of the ecosystem, which is often required with other batch methods of vermicomposting. Continuous flow bins can be large or small, ranging from a small DIY solution to the largest 120 foot CFTs found in some of the world's largest vermicomposting operations. The Michigan Soil Works CFT targets mid-scale operations with a modular design. Each CFT module is four feet by eight feet and can be attached to one another up to a maximum of 40 feet, which is of course five modules. What this means is that an operator or a business can purchase the CFT that fits their current operation. And then as their business or operation expands, they can purchase additional modules to tack on to their existing Michigan Soil Works CFT. This modular capability is what makes this product unique but it's only possible because of the precision design and manufacturing that allow standardization from one module to the next. So in the next video, we're gonna discuss how the Michigan Soil Works CFT is designed, manufactured, and ultimately assembled to serve your operation. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.